New life for old sugarcane land on Maui. Today, Mahipono planted its first crop since purchasing more than 41,000 acres from Alexander and Baldwin last year. Maui Now's Wendy Osher reports. Mahipono executives called the event a historic moment for Maui as it transitions towards diversified agriculture. Lawmakers say the ceremonial event signals a return of active agricultural production to central Maui and the re-greening of the central plains. Well, flying in from Oahu, I, I, it just broke my heart to see how dry it was and so I was so excited to see the plantings begin. The very first crop is on 40 acres in central Maui and includes yellow, white, and red potatoes, which will be ready for harvest in about three months. According to Mahipono, the choice in crop was twofold, first looking at ways to become more sustainable by replacing imported products with those that are locally grown. In addition, you know, the potatoes would do other things to help our soil remediate itself. Um, and there's, you know, I think the opportunities for us to kind of move forward on a crop that uh, wouldn't need windbreaks. Um, to be put up ahead of time was also another factor of why potatoes were first. The ceremonial planting occurred as a 200-acre fire burned to the northeast in old sugarcane lands in Pa'ia. We asked company managers what's being done to maintain their thousands of acres that are still unplanted amid the summer fire season. We're maintaining fire breaks and we're, we're trying to reduce risk in areas that we know will have uh, either high susceptibility to fire or potential damage to structures or, or, or risk to people. As part of the maintenance strategy, strands says large fire breaks have been cut along Haleakala Highway, below the Pukalani community, and around the Maui Base Yard. Over the next three and a half years, Strand says all of the company's acreage will have some type of crop on it. Most of it in permanent crops and trees, uh, citrus, avocados, macadamia nuts, um, and, and coffee. And so as we move into that, uh, certainly this is the first step for us in planting potatoes in, in moving towards um, converting all these brown dry acres into um, viable cropland. Other crops scheduled for planting in 2019 include avocados and papayas. This is in addition to cover and forage crops which are currently being planted. For KHON2 News on Maui, I'm Wendy Osher with Maui Now.